up, homies? It's Marissa. So today I'm going to be doing a thrift haul. Can we go thrift shopping? What? 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 Oh my god, all these clothes. So the first thing that I got was just like this, um, kind of like a sweater dress, and it's a like kind of a cream color, sort of. It's like kind of like a slight V-neck, and I think it's supposed to be a regular sweater, but I'm gonna use it as a dress because it's an extra large tall. So the next thing that I got was just like this robe. I thought it was a kimono at first, but it's like it's like ten feet tall. Dude. Don't walk around the house naked. Wear a freaking robe at least. So this kind of like reminds me of a Japanese type robe, and it has like flowers on it, cherry blossoms or whatever they're called. The next thing that I got, okay, so my mom thinks this is the ugliest thing she's ever seen in her life. But I'm gonna try to make it into like a short dress. Um, it's just like kind of like a granny nightgown um, thing. And it's kind of like a v-neck, but next time you see this, it's gonna be looking cute. But uh, I thought this was pretty rad. I thought this was like, you know, kind of like um, a vintage dress. The next thing I got was probably one of my favorite purchases. Okay, so this is like a really long dress. It's kind of like an army green color. Pretty much everything that I got was army green. So yeah, and it has kind of like this sexy kind of slit down the leg. Girl, be looking fly. You show those thighs. All right, so yeah, it makes you look really thin. Um, so yeah, I like it a lot. So the next thing I got, honestly, I don't think I'll ever wear this or when I will ever wear it. Everything just fell! Sweet! I just got this and it's whatever, so uh, yeah. It's just this um, can't get enough shirt. And this is obviously a nightgown and when they're talking about can't get enough, they're talking about sleep. Speaking of sleep, I did not get one minute of sleep last night because I was up watching One Tree Hill. Um, yeah, it's getting really good. Is Peyton gonna die? What the heck? Holy crap. How did that, how did, how did this shirt drift down to one tree So the next thing that I got was just like this Banana Republic shirt. Um, it's just like a kind of like, I think this is the halter top, but I'm not sure. It's kind of like baby blue and it's just, I feel like you could wear this with high waisted shorts and some white Converse. I think that looked really, really rad. And so, yeah. The next thing that I got was just this kind of fancy shirt. So my mother says that I never dress up. She says I dress like a hobo. And I'm just like, well, if this is how hobos dress, then I want to be a hobo, so. So I did get just a fancy shirt. These little triangle things kind of remind me of a, uh, like, paper planes. At the bottom, it's just like pink. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I just burped, I don't know if you heard that. The next thing that I got was just kind of this uh, old lady knitted cotton candy shindig. Like digging this sh thing. This thing. Hi, babe. All right, so this is like fish kind of button up that you could probably wear with um, high-waisted shorts. This is so freaking cool, dude. Like there's like goldfish in a bowl and there's just like free fish and then there's like two fish, blue fish, one fish, two fish. Dr. Seuss, thanks for teaching me that. The next thing that I got was probably one of my favorite purchases. Yeah, I thought this was like really, 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 really cool. Um, it kind of has like, it's like this palm tree type thing, little huts on it. And then at the bottom, it has like really cool beading detailing, which I thought was really, really cute and really, really cool. And uh, yeah, you could probably wear it with high-waisted shorts. How many times am I gonna say high-waisted shorts within this video? So the next thing I got was just this white and black halter top. I've been wanting a white and black one for a really, really, really long time. And um, I finally found one. You can wear it with high-waisted shorts and you can either wear, you can even wear like a jean jacket over it, um, which would be really, really cool. I really like this a lot. I like it. Um, you could just, you know, wear it with high-waisted shorts. I'm pretty sure I already said that. And this is just like a really cool, so the next thing that I got, I'm going to North Carolina in two days. So um, I'm actually going on Saturday. And so I just thought this would be like a really cool thing that I could wear over my bikini. 
when I go to the beach and it's just kind of like an army green color and it has like these little beading detailing on it which I thought was really 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 cool um it's just like holy so you can just wear this over your bikini so the next thing I got was actually inspired by my mother yes my mother inspired me holla at your girls so my mom I saw this picture of her she was standing in front of her high school and um she was wearing like this really big like giant white sweatshirt with like this logo on it but the one that i got doesn't have a logo on it some like i think they were like high-waisted shorts and then she was wearing like adidas superstars and i'm actually purchasing those uh, this month and then so i was like i have to literally recreate this outfit because my mom had really great style but now she's all business will meet me all right so let's just let me just show you what the sweatshirt looks like um it's kind of like a pink like like a pink undertoned off white color and this is just by Gap. This I could wear with leggings and Adidas Superstars or I could wear it with high waisted shorts and Adidas Superstars. Either way, I would look better than your mom. Better than my mom. So uh, yeah. The next thing that I got all right, so the next thing that I got was just this windbreaker. I've been wanting a freaking windbreaker for a very long time. And I finally found one for like two bucks. And I was just like, this is mine. I love it. So it's just kind of like this um, like lavender blue type color. And um, it just kind of has like this patch on it, which I have no idea what this means. It's just kind of like a really rad patch. And it has like... Um, you know, what are these called? Pockets. So the next thing that I got was just this polo, and this is like a three large or three X or whatever it's called. But um, it's just like really, really, really big. It like passes my knees, and I wear this to bed with like no pants because I don't wear pants to bed because I feel like that's really uncomfortable, and it is not okay to wear pants during the summer because you will die of a heat stroke. So the next thing that I got was like um, like this chevron pattern, kind of like a crop oh, like crop top with, um, you know, a long sleeve. And this is kind of like a cream, dark, navy blue type shindig thing. So this was one of my favorite purchases ever, dude. Like, holy crap. Okay, so this, doesn't this remind you of like, so have y'all ever read the book? What is that book called? It's like, um, I read it in eighth grade. It was in my eighth grade summer reading book. And it was like, um, the grease, it has the greasers and the socks or whatever. Dang, that was like my favorite book for the longest time. I don't remember the name of it. I just searched what it's called and it is called The Outsiders. Okay, so that was my favorite movie of all time in eighth grade. Like I got super obsessed with the book and then I saw the movie and I cried and I cried and I cried. I know I cried. I don't remember all the characters' names, but um, I think one, I think Johnny died. Was it Johnny that died? I don't know. Like this reminds me of the greasers so much, kind of like the shirts they would wear. They wouldn't wear navy blue striped shirts, but they would wear shirts kind of like this style. And um, I thought it was like really, really cute. And I was just like, I have to get this shirt. The next thing that I got was just this random like tie dye shirt. And I liked it because it said like indecision all over it into like a water drop, which I thought was really, really cool. And like random people signed the back. Um, so I was just like, you know what? This, I'm gonna carry on the names of these people. The next thing I got was like a really, really cool purchase. I really, really liked it a lot. And um, it just kind of has like these mirrors, almost like these mirror tribally detailing. Do you see like how it looks like mirrors on the side? And this vest is really, really cool. And it's like a kind of like a, um, a tuxedo kind of material. It's really thick and really, really heavy. But um, you know what? I don't care. So the next thing that I got was just this like red halter top. It's like has like two black lines. It has two little baby pockets and then it's like a zipper. I thought this was really, really cute and kind of like summery. I think you can wear halter tops with pretty much anything and it would look okay. Like you wouldn't be judged because it would look good. So the next thing I got, I think it's kind of nerdy, but Honestly, this reminds me of like a kind of like an alien type galaxy thing and my mom was like Marissa Why are you getting that? That's so ugly. And I was like mom Because I want to get it. Let me be me. 
please don't judge me. All right, but like literally it kind of like kind of has like a galaxy type thing. Look at this. And it kind of has like this athletic t-shirt kind of feel to it. And it's just like a really long short sleeve shirt. And yeah. So the next thing that I got was just this um, kind of like kind of knitted material. And it's the crop top and or halter top. It's kind of like the mix of both. And I thought it was really, really cute. Um, and it has like these little button things. You could obviously wear this for high-waisted shorts. The next thing that I got was just kind of like this, um, it was like, the brand is Kinesis, and it obviously looks like a workout shirt, but I thought it was really, really cute, and it kind of has like this peach kind of color on the shoulders, and it's kind of like a halter top. So the next thing that I got was this kind of really cute uh, tie-dye shirt, but it looks like it's supposed to be past your shoulders, which I thought was kind of like 80s. And um, it's just like purple tie-dye, and the back says, follow the glory of the beads, which I have no idea what that means. Hey, follow the glory of the beads. Hey. The next thing that I got was just this um, kind of like, like an older lady type thing, and it's kind of short, but then again, it's not short at all. And it kind of just has like palm trees on it, which I thought was really, really cool. And it's like this button up and it's kind of like an army green color and it's really, really cute. The next thing that I got was just this regular, um, you know, uh, long sleeve t-shirt. It's kind of, it looks like it's shorter than the average long sleeve t-shirt, but it's like really, really cute. And it's like a light material. The next thing that I got was just kind of like this short black. It's like kind of, it's like shorter than the average. Like the shirt, like some of these shirts are sh like not a halter top and not a crop top, but it's shorter than the average shirt. But I really, really like this because it's so simple. It's just like something you could throw on. Like if you don't know what to wear in the morning, it's something that you could just easily throw on with some jeans. So the next thing that I got was just this kind of like, hope. this is obviously Hawaiian because it says Maui. But it's like really cool because it kind of has like a fish on it and it's kind of faded, which I really like that because it looks cool. And it kind of looks like acid wash on it, on the t-shirt. Like, I don't know if you can kind of see that, but I thought it was really, really cool. And it's it's pink, so I don't really think pink is my color, but I'm just going to try it out because, you know, who cares? It's just a t-shirt. I'm always just going to wear this to school on my lazy days because I don't see it. So that's my whole thrift store haul. I really hope you like this video. Like subscribe, comment down below if you've ever gone through shopping, and um, I really hope you like this video, I think I've said that, so peace out homies, um, oh yeah, yeah, oh, okay, the last thing that I got, the last thing that I got was just this um, really cool, like, um, shirt that's kind of like religious, so if you're not a really religious person, then I mean, obviously you would be into this, I got this out of thrift store, and so, um, it, it said God is dead, and then God said Nietz is dead. I thought this was a really, really cool shirt. Like, honestly, this is a really, really rad shirt. Like I said, I'm going to North Carolina in two days, so I'm going to be doing vlogs and videos with my sister because I'm going up to go see my sister. And um, so I'll be doing a vlog of my whole entire trip, and then I'll also be doing, um, you know, just videos with my sister. And um, yeah, I really hope y'all like this video. Um, now it's the end. So shopping is good for the soul, guys. Uh, peace out. Have a good day. Um, and yeah.